There we are. Six in the morning. It's early, but not criminal. Weather seems okay. The rain stopped. It is cold. It's freezing right now, but it's supposed to be maybe warm enough to go. And all we're worried about, really, I think, is the clouds. I'm pretty excited. I've been to many a rocket launch, but I have never been to a supersonic test flight at all. So this going to check it off, the old aerospace box. Okay, while the planes come out of the hangar, they are obviously fueling it up, doing some of the last checks. Previously, the XB-1 has hit Mach 0.95, 5% shy of supersonic. Essentially, we all know what's going to happen today, but the flight has an extra special ceremonial detail. History is made by this aircraft, the XS-1, and its pilot, Captain Charles E. Yeager. The plane will enter what's called the Bell X-1 Supersonic Corridor, the airspace named after Chuck Yeager's plane when he first broke the sound barrier back in 1947. And for the nerds live streaming at home, don't worry, Boom's got you covered. Welcome everyone, wherever you are in the world. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Here we are at the Mojave Air and Spaceport. Thank you so much for joining us. And we're off. Come on, baby. We're in the air. And she's airborne. I just said that, dude, come on. Wow, that was fantastic. Doesn't she look gorgeous? Easy, Tiger, it's just a plane. Kenny Loggins, I can feel you. And there it is. History has been made. Cue the old-timey newsreel music. Ashley Vance, reporting from Mojave, California. 